Okay, hey guys, today will be the hopefully final part of the blacksmith shop, and it's part five. So, and it's just the minor details that have been added in the past video. So, yeah, it's just this weapon rack. You need this 2 by 4 piece, and it's also this anvil, and then putting it all together. So, yeah, you will just need random weapons. I used a shield as well. But you just need random weapons, and I'll start with this one. This one's very simple. Slide this out of the way. This one's very simple, and I'll get the weapons that I used on this one. I use these two weapons. So it's just really simple, very, very basic. Just a few pieces, and you can go ahead and take a look at the pieces you will need. Those do not have to be that color. So, yeah, those are the pieces you need for that. So, now I'll go ahead and build it. You just slide these together, like just like that. Take the 2 by one put it on top. Take this 2 by one but tall, put it right there. Take this piece, this kind of weird angle piece, put it right there. And take this piece and this piece and just stick them right there and then put just weapons just on there. So, yeah, you can use any weapons you want and then you can go ahead and take the 2 by 4 and st stick it on there. Now for the shorter of the two. If you're going to use a shield, um, then you make this. But if you're not going to use the shield, just two more weapons, then just use another one of these. So, yeah. Now go ahead and pull out the pieces you need for this. And this can be a 2x2, two two, but I, a 2x2 two two with the slants. But I only had the two one by twos, so I had to use those. So yeah, go ahead and take a look at the pieces you will need. And the reason I didn't do that with the other big ones is because the big ones didn't have as little of pieces. So first, I'll start off with the base. You take your two by two thing, and you take this, and just, this is a three like this tall, th no two of those, but then added together it would be three, then on top of this it will be four tall studs tall, so yeah. So yeah, you can go ahead and add that there. Then take this piece, if you're going to add a shield, take this piece and this piece and put it on right there. Make sure it's curved that way, not the other way, because the other way you can't hold the shield. So yeah, you just stick it on the other open space. Then you just add your weapons. It might be easier to add the sword first. But yeah. So there's that. And then you put it on the other open space. So go on. There we go. And there's your little weapons weapons rack. So now the anvil. And it's best to have these all in black. So I'll take off the pieces for this. 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 Let me get this piece off. Okay, there's that. And let me... There we go. Okay, so just very simple six pieces, and obviously all in black, or you could do gray or silverish color if you have that. So, just go ahead and look all the pieces. Go ahead and gather the pieces. There you go. So now, how to build it. You take this piece, and this piece, and the stud, and you just stick it right there. And then just 
right in the middle right there or you can use one of those disc things and remove the stud and use one of those disc things and use it like that that will look more realistic but I don't have that so then you take this hook piece put it right there and that will be your back and this cone and that will be your front then you add this and put it right there and there you go here's your anvil and you can hook a sword there like he's working on it like I'll show you you just hook a sword or whatever he's working on right there then you can have him hammer it so yeah time to put this whole thing together so you have all your pieces here all your main parts and this first of all the water thing in the furnace that axe right there and that clip right there you join them together and then it makes that and then here's a piece I forgot to show you but you can if you want to go ahead and curve it like that or if you want it straight like this get a 2x2 two two and just see where right there and right there line up that's where you put that or you could put one of those uh, corner pieces you know that go right there like that if you wanted to but I just use that and then the rest is just to the side you know put to the side the anvil would be around here or maybe around here and here's a hook for one weapon you can find a way to put the anvil right there if you want to but yeah there's a hook for one weapon and another hook that's where I usually put his hammer so yeah then I usually put the helmet right there and the armor right there. So yeah, you can work on like a sword or whatever you want to. This has been a very long edition of how to build a Lego, you know, custom. So it was very long, but you know, yeah. Okay. So yeah, there you go. You got it all built. So see you next time. And goodbye.